In this video, we are going to solve a tricky problem. Though it is very simple, generally students do mistake in this particular question. The number of unpaired electrons present in the species, they are given the species, which is formed during ground ring test. It was asked in gate exam 2010. Brown ring test is used to find out nitrates. For example, say you have one metal nitrate. This we add HTSO4. We dissolve this in water and we add HTSO4. This will be concentrated sulfuric acid. Concentrated sulfuric acid will get settled at the bottom of the test tube. You can find two phases in the test tube. At the junction, MnO3 will react with HSO4. What you get is HNO3. Nitric acid will be formed. Nitric acid is very good oxidizing agent. This HNO3 reacts with Fe2+. To this, we add freshly prepared ferrous sulfate solution. So during that time, these two will react to give Fe, H2O5 and NO, nitroside complex will be formed. This is brown in color. This will be formed at the junction as a ring, so that is brown ring test. Now we have to find out the oxidation state of iron in this species. Based on that, we have to find out how many unpaired electrons will be there. The given species is Fe, H2O, 5 times, NO and 2 plus. The ligands can be classified into three types. First one is neutral. Like water, ammonia, CO, they are neutral ligands. Next one is anionic ligands like Cl minus, CH3 minus, they are anionic. Last one, cationic ligand. Here we have NO. Nitrocell ligand is cationic ligand. When you have neutral ligand, you have to consider zero for them. Anionic ligand, you have to consider minus one to find out the oxygen state, cationic ligand, you have to consider plus one. For example, let's consider Pt, Cl4, 2 minus. To find out the oxygen state of platinum, what I do, I take the oxygen state of platinum as X. For Cl, I take minus one. There are four Cl, so I get four into minus one. After that, I go for the charges. What I get is x is equal to minus 2 plus 4 this plus 2. This is how we find out the oxygen state. Here Cl is anionic ligand so I have taken minus 1. NO is cationic ligand so I have to take plus 1 to find out the oxygen state. For Fe I take x. There are 5 water molecules. So I put 0 since it is neutral again. Only one nitro cell is there. So it is plus 1. The other side plus 2. X will be 2. The other side it will become minus 1. So X is equal to plus 1. The oxygen state of iron in this species is plus 1. Now let's try to find out the electronic configuration for Fe plus 1. This will be the arrangement of electrons. In d orbital there will be 6, in s orbital there will be only 1. Let us place 6 electrons here. 1 electron here. Generally students do like this and this is a wrong. And they get 5 as answer. 
the presence of ligands the electron whatever is present in s orbital that will be shifted to d orbital so what we get is d7 configuration further in the presence of ligand the d orbitals are getting split into t to g and e g now let's place the seven electrons like this since water is weak ligand i place singly then i go for pairing this is the exact electronic arrangement in this species you should not follow this this will give wrong answer now i have only three unpaired electrons so the correct answer is three try to find out the electron count for this species question may be asked based on that also in fact it is a tricky question try to find out